So sites, PDFs and documents can be an absolute pain when you're working with LLMs. There's images to captions, tables need to be extracted, and what happens if you've got things like formulas and code? Vision language models do make this a ton easier. Let's take a look how to do it with Docling. Alrighty, so we've got this stock announcement. It's a share announcement from the ASX on a particular ETF. You can see that we've got a bunch of information on here. So we've got some text, we've got some images, we've got some tables, which are always a bit tricky. So how do we go about extracting this if we wanted to put inside of a RAG or retrieval augmented generation pipeline? Well, we can use vision language models. So to do this, I've got a terminal inside of VS Code. I've got a Docling pre-installed. I'll include the installation instructions inside the description. Maybe I'll link to a GitHub repo as well. We can go UV run Docling. So I've installed it using UV. And then I'm gonna go dash dash two. So this specifies what format I wanna take that particular document, in this case, this PDF, and export it to using the vision language model. So we're gonna to say to Markdown. Then we need to specify what type of pipeline we wanna use. So we are going to use a VLM pipeline, which is vision language models. And then I'm gonna specify the model that I wanna use. So I'm gonna go VLM dash model. And then we wanna specify that we want it to be granite Docling. And then the last thing that we need to do is pass through the link to the file that we wanna process. So it'll download it, it'll process it, and it should ideally spit it out to a markdown document. If I go and run that, let's see how we go. Take a look, we're running. I'm just gonna hide myself so you can see. And take a look, we've gone and processed that document in 20.68 seconds. And over here, we've got the format that it's been output to as well as the file name. So 06LLN61SBJ, whatever the rest you can see there. Take a look, our file is over here. So if we go and open it up, we can actually go and take a look at the preview. Let me unhide myself, boom, boom. All right, and if I go and preview, so open preview, boom, there is our file. Let me zoom out a little bit. So you can see that it's actually gone and processed it into Markdown, but specifically, take a look, it's gone and extracted this whole table, which I think is absolutely cool considering it did in 20.6 seconds. I just think that is absolutely ridiculously efficient. If we actually go and take a look, interest subject to non-resident withholding tax was 10.8, uh, 0.1083%. If we go and scroll up, take a look, that's the file number there. Oh, that's the interest percentage there. We're matching up. There's a bunch more demos in this hugging face space, which shows you what you can do next. You literally don't need to do anything. You can go and test it all out yourself. You can see it caption images, convert scanned code to text, and my personal favorite, chart extraction.